Why? Because, bitch, you were taking too long. Welcome to a crap guide to D and D. Fighting is like a science and can be used for either side of the moral spectrum. It can be used for evil, like punctuating arguments, expressing a salty loss, and beating up nerds. Or it can be used for good, like self-defense, artistic expression, and beating up nerds. And monks are those who have trained heavily in the nerd beating up science of mixed martial arts, foregoing any sort of traditional filthy weapon proficiencies, and instead opting for wanting to punch, bam, boom, slam, kick, punch stuff. You start with no armor because, like a barbarian, you have the ability to deflect and dodge attacks with the power of your unconstrained birthday suit. But unlike barbarian, you don't have to rely on the pathetic material world to explodify goblins. You have your knuckles. Martial arts training means you can serve up extra punchables for the bad guys as a bonus action, so no matter how you're doing as Mama said, you'll be dishing out more pain-induced fistings than two lesbians who consider watching porn as a reasonable substitute for sex ed. But it's not all coochie destruction, the monk is a slippery piece of work who's really good at avoiding any oncoming fistings like a millennial trying to get their life together avoids self-care by catching them if they're a fist projectile or dodging out of the way if it's an area of fists. As you grow stronger, you can translate a fist if it's punching in a different language and avoid any infections if the fister forgot to take a shower that night. As a monk, your shtick is the key feature, but since I can't come up with any way to make this section much funnier, and also because key translates to poop and tie, that's how I'm going to refer to it from now on. You gain more and more poop as you level up, and you can spend your poopy points on various skills to do all sorts of things, like sun people, reroll saves, mask yourself and turn invisible, and any other number of crazy things based on which anime you want to imitate. I would recommend Kensei so you could use the dual wield chainsaw shotgun laser earrings if it weren't for the fact that every other archetype was just cooler in every way, wearing fancy outfits and taking the time to actually learn how to fist properly. Oh man, what a tough decision. Do I want to use a pokey stick or do I want to fire Hadoukens and Kamehameha blasts? What an enticing decision. I'm really gonna have to think about it. Don't stop! Don't stop! We're in luck now! And now you know how to play Monk. You're welcome.